Hello there, my name is Will, and today I will be going over a custom formula I made by my own self that details a predicted amount of coffees you should consume in a day for optimal levels of work. Now keep in mind, I am not at all a doctor whatsoever, so this is just something I will have thumb to go by. So this formula is C equals X minus S. Now what the heck does that mean? I'll tell you. C is the daily amount of coffees predicted to consume. X is what is called a stress factor. I will detail that in a minute. And S is your hours of sleep you got the night before. So let's talk about the stress factor. It's basically a number to assign to that X value in the formula that details your amount of work in terms of hours usually, or the difficulty as well, but whatever. So if you're a student in high school, that you would use a value of eight. College undergrad nine, uh, grad student 10. If you work between zero to four hours, you would get value of eight. More than four, but less than eight hours would be nine. And then eight to 10 would be value of 10. If for some reason you work 10 or more hours in one day, that's a lot. So you would use a value of 12. So you might say, well, what if I do both? I will give you a personal example I used on Wednesday. So I worked between eight to 10 hours. So that's a value of 10. So we're solving for X right here. So X equals, to use that 10. But I also was a grad student on Wednesday. So I would use 10 but I was only doing it for part of a day. I was mainly working, so 10 divided by two. You take whichever one you do more, take it at its full value, and if you do another one, you take it at half. So there we go, 10 plus, 10 over two, which is five, so 10 plus five gives you 15. So you plug that 15 in for X at the formula, so you got your C, your coffees should be 15 minus the hours of sleep, which I got was seven that previous night. I slept well. So 15 minus seven equals eight. So I should have had eight coffees in the day, which I did. Set a personal record. So I would recommend testing this formula out for yourself you want an optimal level of output at work or school, whichever one you, you do. But yeah, let me know what you think of this formula, if it needs to be adjusted at all, or if I'm missing a variable. But this is just something I use throughout my everyday life. I think I've averaged about five coffees for the past month, uh, per day, obviously. So yeah, let me know in the comments. And thank you.